Hey, Mr. Walrus. Fancy a race? Fancy a little competition? Well, sure. I mean, I'm fat, but I'm not as fat as you, so this should be, uh, this should be a snap. Uh, this should be a snap. Uh, this should be a snap. All I have to do is steer the sled through the red slums. Three, two, one, zero, one and a half, two. Okay, so basically I think the strategy for this race, it, there's another slalom race way that we need the, uh, that we need to be a Baron Bird for, and we need that, that, uh, the sneaker slippery things. I don't know what they're called. I should look these things up. I'm just making up names for everything. I don't have any official names except for ticker. But I think the real strategy is supposed to be, like, it's, it's very easy to steer. But I think the main strategy you're supposed to do, or you're supposed to have, is to get in front of them and then stay in front of them and not get stuck on houses. But he, he's kind of, uh, did I, there was a, was it, oh wait, I, did, I, did, I, I, I missed it. Okay, I'm gonna have to restart. Sorry. This is too easy, I'm giving up. And that looks like a death animation, but it's not. That's another thing that I learned. But this should be a snap. Come on, Mr. Walrus. Jump on this lead and try again. Yeah. Okay, I just double-checked to make sure that wasn't the death animation. I, have, I still have all my notes. And we're about to be at 15 minutes here, so, uh... Hmm. Well, I'm not gonna cut it off here right before a race. I still have a few more... I'm just gonna keep going. But my original plan was to just make every video roughly 15 minutes because I want them to be shorter, but I'll make this go on a little bit longer just to see where it goes. Okay, so we'll get through all the slaloms this time. This kind of makes me think of Mario, Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Or the Olympic Winter Games. I think that's so weird how they say Olympic Winter Games instead of Winter Olympic, uh, Winter Olympic Games. Just, just why, I don't understand. Not that it's even that great of games. Okay, I prefer the Summer Olympic Games. For some reason. I think, I don't know, Summer Moods and Games in general I think I like more than Winter Feels. Like Freeze Easy I think this world is cool, especially for Snow World. But I, I prefer to play a game. Oh, no, 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 no. Man, okay, I'm going to have so much fail on this, it's not funny. Like, I, every time I've done this, I've done it on the first try, but not this time. I really hope this works, but it's not going to work, because I'm failing. I'm failing miserably. I'm behind the pack. Okay, go, go, faster. Go through the stupid thing, Walrus Bear. And fail. <sighs> Fake death animation again. But this should be a snap. Now I'm going to pause one more time, because I'm, I'm curious if... Oh, okay, that's not doing anything to my health, because I've lost twice. And there's only one missing, so that's nice. Jump on the sled! Good luck, kid! Three, two, one, go! Good luck, you're gonna need it! Slaloms! I can't hear the music, so I don't know what to sing to. I'm not singing to anything. Do 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 do. I'm just going to assume that it's a faster paced version of the Freeze Easy Peak theme, which I can't remember what it's called. Another thing I could do, because I talked about the nuts and bolts music, I could just put that here right now. Yeah, I figured it might help if I didn't talk for a few seconds. So... Yeah, but, this, but the strange thing about that music uh, to me, the Banjo Land, or that's Banjo Land, that's the music, that's the level in the game where that music is, the Freeze Easy Peak remix, orchestrated remix, which is amazing. Uh, it's kind of weird to me, because Banjo Land in, the, in Nuts and Bolts is just this very, it's just, I don't know, it's like a, not exactly a generic area, but it's just full of all the kind of different, it's full of all the kind of different uh, generic, I don't know, game level things all in one place. Like it has a water area and it has sort of a, me a mechanical looking area and it has like a ice area. I'm saying like too much. But you just kind of roam around and the music stays the same. And what it is, is it's just... I'm bad at explaining things. Uh, what the music is for Banjo Land, it's basically just like a remix of six or seven different Banjo Kazooie songs, Banjo Banjo Kazooie and Banjo Tooie songs, and they just kind of go in a row. They just go one after another. And Freeze Easy Peak is one of the many themes, and I think another one is uh, well, that would have been a spoiler if I said that. One of them is a Gobi's Valley theme. Another one I think is just the uh, I think it's just a regular Banjo Kazooie theme. Okay, I'm tired of this form. Turn me back into my true self. Of course, I can't hear him say that, so it doesn't. It's not genuine. Whoa, 19 minutes? Oh crap! Well, I don't want this to be any more than 20. I never want any of these to be more than 20. Okay, we have 91 notes. You know what? Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just gonna keep going, and this might be two episodes. You probably have seen this, or. <laughs> I don't know, I might have, I, I probably would have made an awkward cut somewhere in there. Like, you, you, you will know this, but I'm going to try something different, which you will probably already see. Oh, crap. I forgot to get these as a walrus. These are the last few notes we need, though. We have plenty of health. We can get them. 
Um, I'm just gonna keep going and collect all the other jig 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 that I need. Get that stupid note, banjo. Bare face. I don't want to lose all my life though, so I'm gonna go and find crap. I'm gonna go and find crap. I'm gonna eat that crap, and I'm gonna feel better. But what you, will, what you will have seen is me randomly cutting off the video without this one having an intro, and you're just gonna see where it comes out, and oh, I can't, okay, no, wait, I don't want this race, I can't do this race yet, I have to go to World 6 to do this race. Uh, okay, go on without me. Go on without me, Boggy. I don't need you, and you don't need me. We're a happy family. Oh wait, did I lose health for that? I lost health. Wait, no I didn't. Did I? Did I? I don't know. Come on, buddy, try again. I don't... Okay. B to back out. B, good. All I wanted to do was break this. And get health. Sweet, sweet life. Sweet, sweet life energy. Quite literally, it's very sweet. It's honey. I want to shut you up, Boggy. I want to take your mouth and duct tape it and stitch it closed and then feed it to piranhas and then shove it further into that giant nose of yours and uh, make you eat it. Uh, how do you eat your mouth? I have no idea, but people have done it before, I think. Get that note. I have only, I have only those two notes left to get. And I don't have to worry about coming back here for the 100 note thing again. Hooray! But where are those last couple of jiggies that we can get? One of them is going to be the Nwaz's cave. Oh yeah, and one of them is the present, <clears throat> the present one. Yeah, that's it. We just have to give the presents back to the greedy little crying kids. Well, to be honest, I have no idea where the other Jinjo. Oh, wait. One of the Jinjos, I know exactly where it is. I can't believe I forgot to get this one. Uh, this snowman happens to be a janitor. And he's ha he has a broom somewhere around here. Where's his broom? Okay, there we go. There's a Jinjo that we're missing. Jinjo! Whee! I haven't made any Jinjo quotes this part in this level. Well, I okay, let's see. Jinjo! I don't think we're in Kansas anymore! Okay, there we go. That's one. Why have I passed by this guy so many times and I haven't even bothered to get any of his health? I am so dumb, I am a stupid, moron, jerk-face, idiot, patootie-face. I'm tired of playing through this level, because I had to do this, this the save file thing and beat all the first four worlds over again, because I've played this twice now. Although that was surprisingly painless, actually, because the first four worlds of the game are pretty fun. And this game is fun. It's just, I've realized that it's more fun to just play than it is to let's play. Not that let's playing isn't fun, because it is. I just think, I'm just starting to think that maybe I should have started with a different game, because this is... The fact that this doesn't autosave, and the fact that all of it is collecting, and you have to go all over the place and all the levels to get to the right point and at which you're supposed to do stuff, and... It's just harder than I expected. I still have not collected all the Jinjos. I need to find that last one. I might have to cut to that or something. But anyway, here you go, greedy child. My name is Santa. Uh, that'll be $4,000. Well, a Jiggy, that's good, too. I'll take that. Although I don't know why you would part with a giant piece of gold for these three little presents that you're being given. Although I, I can see the appeal. I mean, they have... Like, they're... they're they have, uh... They're very lively. They're very lively presents. They probably have, you know... Uh, flesh-eating weasels inside. Elusive orange snow-loving Jinjo? <laughs> that's dumb. That's stupid. Is it over here? I'd be really I would feel really dumb if it was in like an obvious place, like at the top of this. Okay, no it is not. Oh wait, that's the Waza's cave one. I'm do I'm a doofus. I am a doofenshmirtz. Ah, Perry the Pilatopus. Well I can't do the impression. And then Waza's gonna freak out when he sees this bear. Oh my goodness, there's a bear who is like one-ninth of my size, and he's going crazy, going into this collective... I love how he says the orange thing. Please take the orange thing with you. 
That's just so insulting to the Jinjo. It's such an insulting term. Okay. So if you will notice here, this is another stop and swap thing. There's supposed to be a rotating ice key floating over there, and there's supposed to be a big uh, wall of glass or ice or something that's right here, but there's not one. If I entered that room, you would hear this big fanfare, and you, it would be like... Well, it would, be, it would seem pointless because there's nothing there because I've already collected the ice key, but if you didn't do the stop and swap thing, that's where there should be an ice, there, there should be an ice wall or a glass wall or whatever it is. So we have done everything that we need to do in Freeze Easy Peak, and this, this run was a whole lot better than my other one. And I think I'm learning now that I should just record everything twice. Because... <laughs> I mean, even even now, I'm I'm gonna be missing things. Like I, I realized before, or I realized recently, that I was I actually missed a Bubble Gloop Swamp Mumbo's token that was right next to another one. I don't know if I even want to show that, but it's one of the only one, or it's one of the ones that you can only get as a crocodile in the crocodile form, and it's 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 seriously like three feet away from another one. So wow, your best note for score for this world is now 100, or. Or whatever is whatever it is in Spanish or French or I don't know languages. I'm never gonna learn another language besides English, unless it's like <clears throat> unless it's like uh, JavaScript or something. Because I'm a nerd. I'm fluent in JavaScript as well as Klingon. Except I don't I don't care much for Klingon. I'm not a Star Trek person. I'm also not much of a Freddy Cougar person. So why am I thinking about that when I look at this Grunty statue? I don't know. So next time on P P P Jinjo Kazooie. I think we're going to be going to Gobi's Valley. Yeah, I'm going to have to practice that because I haven't practiced that yet. And we're going to go to Gobi's Valley and we're going to go straight there. We're probably not going to do anything else beforehand and we're going to have a lot of fun there because it's full of pyramid tombs, full of death. It's going to be great. Bye. Thank you for watching.